Mixed Martial Bulls, I remember the Mixed Martial Orcs. Mixed Martial Orcs was a great name. Mixed Martial Bulls, not so much. Um, let's see what he's got. He's got <laughs> a four mighty blow. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, okay. Dirty player. 12 guys. Pretty, pretty, pretty good team, really. The Bulls aren't that good, but then. The Bulls are big targets for Clawpom anyway, aren't they? So Yeah, Mixed Martial Orcs was fantastic. Like, that was actual genius, Mixed Martial Orcs. But, um... Mixed Martial Bulls is just crap, isn't it? I guess he does want everyone to know that, yeah. Yeah. If if you lose to them, yeah, brown slugs, because they've got squishy ones that you feel like you should be removing. And when you don't remove them, it's annoying. And obviously there the bulls can be. The bulls can be game winners, can't they? Though his bulls are pretty shit. I guess one's just died. So you, you know, bribe. Bribe and a dirty player. Oof. Oof. And he's got four mighty blow, I think. Yeah, the the fact they get claw, he doesn't have claw though, does he? So I think a dwarf team of that TV would be scarier, really. Just because he'd have, like, they'd have two Pom, Troll Slayers, and more Guard and more Mighty Blow. <laughs> and he bought the Apo as well. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough scumming. I would scum as well if I was 280 down. Can't blame him for that. Oh, conflicts and milk, well done. That's that's definitely good dice to... They're, they're the best person's level dice to steal, I guess. Yeah, it's got strength four. I just, I had an agility five ball on some once, and it was like the most cheating thing in the world. Hello, Lil Baz. Not really. <laughs> Not really. They are in a qualifying position, but they're under severe threat from Andy Debo. He, he hasn't snuck in front. He's just in He's in pole position. He needs three wins in a row to get above them. And so it's just so easy for him to get in front that I thought, I'll just play like, you know, 10 games if I have to. If I play 10 games and like, you know, do all right, I should... Um, should make it safe because they're still just second aren't they, at the moment anyway. So if I can get in the first place, um, then that will be something on it. Wow, the, the the ball carry is already off the pitch, and I've still got to put somebody good on the LOS. Fuck's sake! That's stupid. Maybe maybe I just have to put the dirty player on the other way. Keep the wrestle frenzy guy. Oh god, he's just gonna mighty blow my guys. I should really win the toss against Bash team, shouldn't I? That that's a good strategy. Blodge break tackle moves I need the wrestle frenzy on the pitch. Start them on the fucking line though, can I? Maybe I have to. Maybe put the guard on the line. Maybe put the warriors on the line. Because he's mostly strength three, isn't he?
fucking rough. Like, I mean, you can still just put guards in and get two on him, then two on him, then two on him. But if he pushes, then it gets trickier, doesn't it? Oh, God. It would su it's gonna suck if anyone dies, Cornflakes and Mel. Too many good players though, yeah. Yeah, he needs three shitters in a row, yeah, he needs three more shitters in a row. Haha, <laughs> hello Valenic. No, of course not. Of course it's not the worst. I mean there's not many good matchups now, is there anymore really? Because the elves are gonna be dangerous. Like, you know, there's no good matchups anymore, is there? If you're playing a two thousand T V elf team, They've got the tools to to win, to roll some dice and win. If you play a 2000 TV bash team, they can win the toss and you just get your team murdered, even if you win or if you somehow draw. And then if you're if people have wizards, you know, bash teams, he's already got loads of mighty blow, he can make kazas, wizard can do something, and any elf team with a wiz can win, can't it? So there's really no good, ma good matchups once you're 2000 TV. At least you're unlikely to face a 2,500 TV team. <laughs> That's the only good thing, I guess. But it's just the, the killingness. Shit opponents go down. Completely clueless opponents go down. Also, completely clueless opponents have much more chance of winning at high TV, don't they? Because they just go... They've just got a mighty blow and stuff. Um... Andy Davos, the threat of Andy Davos forced me to play Will King. Um, because if he plays three shitters on Tuesday, he'll he'll qualify at the moment. So if I... I'm thinking if I just win three in a row, then I'll be top chaos and safe. Um, obviously, if I lose a draw, then I'm probably going to have to play quite a lot of them. So... So... Yeah. Might have to end up playing quite a lot of games today and tomorrow. Well, I think if I do lose a draw, then I should be able to just keep playing and uh, and qualify. Five-man fireball, maybe. Two very high-value players in there as well. Yeah, he doesn't have claw, thanks God. And he does have an unskilled bull. And he's not carrying with a blodge bull, so that's good. And obviously, you know, got a TV. Well, technically a disadvantage now that he's scummed, but um, still, still an actual real TV advantage, isn't it? <laughs> Fuck is this? Oh no, you can push him back. I should have had a gap. Fuck. Yeah, birds are OP, yeah. Hello, Grindle. Yeah, he's gone for the fireball. He's gone for the absolute worst possible move. And gets my killer. Brilliant. Well, I'm so glad I was forced to play Blood Bowl. Brilliant. Oh.
Yeah, minus movement, yeah. Alright, I might just play Bretts then. Might just play eight games of the Bretts. Yeah, Dominic Kevis, it's great, isn't it? Fucking. This is why I hate having to play. But I really had no choice, did I? Because you, you'd be guaranteed to face three noobs and beat them all. You know. That's just the way the world works, isn't it? He obviously gets to crush three noobs while I get fucking dicked on by ridiculous by ridiculous fireball. Yeah, obviously I've got to keep him with minus movement, haven't I? There's no there's no fucking option of, of getting rid of him. It's just so fucking dumb, isn't it? Because try, my opponent is stupid as fuck. Um, but that's what he got. Brilliant, eh? That's his reward for being stupid as fuck. Yeah, five. Standard. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Minus movement's pretty bad. The Dodkagon. <laughs> the Dodkagon's brilliant. That's the only good thing about that fucking shitty wrestling game is that they've got the Dodkagon. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The Attrition Fireball is always wrong. It's, it is always wrong. Attrition Fireball is always wrong. Really, I wouldn't say even say almost always wrong. I would just say it's always wrong. It's different if the attrition aspect is what tempts you to go for a Fireball over a, over a Bolt. But just purely Attrition Fireball is always, always wrong. I would go that far. Yeah, if you've already won the game. Oh yeah, okay, fair enough. Yeah, but then it's not really attrition fireball because then it's just a then it's just a BM fireball, isn't it? <laughs> BM fireballs are pretty good because it means you've won, you've won fair and square without needing one hundred and fifty k inducement.
<laughs> yeah, Harry too, yeah. Yeah, maybe I should just sack everybody just so I can just so I can win and deny Dave all the spot. <laughs> We're at that point already. Yay, a stone. Go me. I just couldn't hit anyone else to die, so I had to do that bit to free him to uh, move back. Yeah, try off to play ten. I'm all, I'm already yeah, unbelievably pissed off. <laughs> Just the thought of having to play blue ball is horrible. Maybe sack everyone just to qualify. It's not the worst idea in the world. Turn them into a min max team just to just to qualify. <sighs> God, I'll just go to sleep during this turn, eh? Birds are top birds. So yeah. They're pretty close. I should put him two back, shouldn't I? So we couldn't do that. It's pretty noobish. Very bad play by me, good play by him. Dirty player died, so it's not like the end of the world. It's just typical, isn't it? Apple was a death. Next cas next block was a death. Hello, Brown Meister. I was, thank you. Now a second destruction derby. I was already a second chaos. Oh really? Oh no. I I Fuck. Mordrek wasn't updated and neither was uh neither was uh neither was uh the ladder just now. I, I checked the ladder and Crimson was still above me. Yeah, of course. <sighs> it's a uh, three AV breaks, three deaths. This was this was an apple. To be fair, the apple was a death. 
rather than initial hit. I feel like just conceding. <laughs> Tilt. All right. Well, um, let's just ban you forever. <laughs> I'm not tilting. <laughs> Oh, I love dice games. All right, I won that. <laughs> Don't say I'm tilting when I've just taken three fucking deaths in three blocks. There's no tilt, is there? There's no tilt in just taking cars. That's just like, you know... Don't don't make me do a fucking loop pack here. Don't even make me do a loop pack. <laughs> Um, when I turn bright red and call somebody a retard. <laughs> that's, that's the loop, I think. Yes! Dude, send in good vibes. <laughs> oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Brennan Slugs. <sighs> How lost that field? Yeah, it's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Three turns. Three turns, three deaths. Although this isn't minus movement, the apple was a death. To be fair, it's much more lucrative to, to snipe somebody playing poker than it is to snipe someone playing Blood Bowl, isn't it? Oh, I'm really pissed if I didn't even have to play. If I become top chaos, I'll be really pissed if I've just fucking played this for no reason. Holy shit. Because they were good in 1900, no, no, no injuries. <laughs> and now they've had three deaths. Oh, thanks, last frogman. <laughs> Ah, oh, thanks, Destruction Derby. So, there you go. I didn't even need to play it. Fuck's sake. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, I don't... He, he can't... I can't win. I could draw if no one else dies. He's already made a big enough mistake using his wizard, hasn't he? So I can draw if nobody else dies. And I'm pissed that I didn't need to play it. Shit. Alright, 
seeing as I know I'm just going to roll a fucking push. Misty plays nice and fast, yeah, I'm alright, Pedro. Yeah, exactly, little Baz. It is what it is. At the end of the day, yeah, look. Uh, it happens sometimes, doesn't it? It's not like... Um, It does happen. So that's what I said, you know, it, do, it does happen, doesn't it? Everyone you play is going to have plenty of mighty blow. Games like this, that's why I wanted to sit on it, even though it was the record wasn't secure. 1900 TV, no injuries, and uh, 150k bank. So it's like... This has obviously got a chance of happening every game, hasn't it, now? Everyone you play is going to have mighty blow. Not that they might not even need it. But everyone you play is gonna have mighty blow and dirty player and they can just they can just get lucky, can't they? It's much easier to get lucky at high T V. That's the thing. Yeah, I've had millions of games like that. I mean that's the thing, I've had millions of games like it as well. So it's nothing new. It's just annoying that I didn't even need to play it in the end. <laughs> Shit. At least he plays nice and fast. That's the worst thing, to be fair. He's killed three people. I didn't even try to stop him. I just huddled together to ignore him. And he's still taking the full three minutes. Every fucking turn. Ah. Um... Yeah, two. Well, it's it's three straight because one was the apple bite sized, so it is three straight deaths in a row because the first one was a minus movement, and then it was three deaths in a row. <laughs> um, yeah, it's one in two hundred sixteen, isn't it? And especially just getting the cars as well is also one in two hundred sixteen. So then you've got two sixteen times two sixteen. Ah, I don't know because then there's mighty blow and stuff, isn't there? Plus then there's the break in the armor, so. Ridiculous. Um, I think elf teams should just play twenty games in champs like that. I think they should play forty, but they should they should min max and then and then up their TV at the end. I think is the way everyone should do it. It's what I did in in fumble when I won that major. To be honest, I uh, I got Nurgle. I went no reroll Nurgle. Um, I went no rerolls. Hovered around sixteen hundred, and then. Uh, Right before the tournament, bought rerolls and a beast, and uh, had a two thousand TV team in the playoffs, which was a pretty good idea, I thought. <laughs> uh. 
Ah, oh, fuck you. you I don't know if there. Fuck. Outrageous. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Unsubbed immediately, Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard. <laughs> ah, well, if he wants to go around this side, I think you know it's a mistake. Um, but so that's why I left that door open. Thank you very much, um, Henry Judas. Thanks for being sub for two months. Thanks for staying fantastic. And uh, I wish you would do as well on my team as you do on Andy Davo's team, but yeah. Rip the team is pretty ripped, ripped aroni there. <laughs> Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard. <laughs> Doesn't know what to do when faced with a non pal. No, I guess this guy. No, I want the garden now. Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard, Jim Shard. <laughs> Jim Shard. Um, <laughs> that's a good point. That's a good point, Brian Slugs. I guess, uh, I guess at the moment, I would rather have diarrhea, but um, you know, with only being two days left of the season. Thanks for the bits, last frogman. Hello, Grindel. Um, yeah. Hopefully, he rolls a double one and his bull dies. That'd be good, wouldn't it? Filling the cup. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Thor. Thanks for the bits. For, I quite like the uh, the old fumble dice for the for the things. Wouldn't it be funny if he didn't score? That would be that would be something else. Jim Shard, 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 Jim Shard. I like how she gets like tired at the end. Jim Shard. Thank you, thank you, last frogman. Jim Shard. He has. He hasn't done a. He hasn't done a good job, has he? To say to say he's killed three players in in three turns. No, oh, this will be a huge AV break if he makes this. Herb, dirt, base, 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 everyone now. Fuck off, man.
He's just done a good job of burning down the clock every turn, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we put it on the list is uh, is don't actually wait until I know I have to win games. I mean, I did know. I I looked on Mordrek. It's just and and I looked on, I looked on the leaderboard, in the game. It's just that he literally finished playing just before this game started. But yeah, results don't matter and qualifying doesn't matter is on the list, but. It's easy to have that on the list, but then once <laughs> once I'm in a qualifying spot and I want to keep it, it does become a little bit important, doesn't it? Jim Shark. Oh man. It just needs to not take ten hours every game every fucking turn. Fuck about. <laughs> no need, is there? <laughs> He's hardly making the tactical moves of the century. Might be able to roll dice to get him. You know Say what else is not long James, little friend named Trash. <laughs> Yeah, infinite pauses, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Les <Lush> Frogman. It's looking less and less likely to. I really needed that power to get through, you know, that was the thing. Really needed that power. Fuck's sake. Like, I can't get a power on four dice. As he just murders the team. <sighs> Can I do a chain? Doubt it. One, two, three, four. Wait, wait, one, two, three, two. If I could chain him. <laughs> How ludicrous is that? Pow him. Pa push him. Get a player, push him. Get him, get two guys around. And chain him, and then knock him over. Then he picks up in a two plus and scores anyway. But all right, I'll try. So I need to put him there, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, and then him. Yeah, it's possible, isn't it? It's po fucking possible, to be fair.
standard. It was, pretty, it was a pretty nice move, wasn't it, to get the 2D on the ball. What was my reward? Not having a reroll for the one turn now. <laughs> he makes the most, the worst decision he can possibly make. Gets the, gets the perm on the fucking killer. Hope he quad skulls here. There's no just a simpler ball, that is true. Wouldn't have been good if you got quads, that would have been justice if you'd rolled quads then. Chance of one turn without a reroll, though. Pretty low. <laughs> it's up to the players to show mercy. <laughs> oh, God. At least I fucking slaughtered him with all this claw anyway. I mean, at least that's something. He was thinking about greed in that, yeah. Unbelievable, Jack. Minus movement barbecue suck. <laughs> Fucking chaos are rowdy as fuck, aren't they? This is why you get Chaos to High TV and get all the auto wins. <laughs> At least he threw his wizard away. That's the only good thing, isn't it? Yeah, obviously, yeah, got to keep him. It's fucking horrific, but got to keep him. Oh, that makes it, that just makes no difference at all. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Right, um... Actually, I can make us a three dice blitz. <laughs> um, so he goes there, he's there. Then he blocks him to there. <sighs> He blitzes. One, two, three, four, five, six. He probably goes two. He's pushed him one forward. He pushes him two forward to there. And he gets him three forward. He only needs to be three forward, doesn't he? Wish I'd saved my reroll for this. I got a reroll.
Jim Shard, 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 Jim Skull. Jim Skull, Jim Skull, Jim it, Jim it. Jim it, Jim it. I don't know if I can take it or not. I guess not. Is that, I presume you should have blitzed the Garda. So then I could have had three dice on them. Yeah, I would have got three dice if I blitzed the Garda. I don't think there's any way back now, is there? Now I get the triple push. Fuck off. Just fuck off. Should have made that three. Thanks for the bits, last frog man. Yeah, I should have should have blitzed the, the guard guy. That was pretty pretty stupid of me. Because I had plenty of players, so my fault. My fault for not blitzing the guard guy at the end of the day. Shit. Shit. Nah, I guess I would have fought, failed at some point. But still. It was just unequivocally the wrong choice, wasn't it, to to not blitz the guard guy. <laughs> boys, boys, lads, lads. Yep, it's not good. Yeah, the the injury was a per minus movement, and apple was a death. So I roll some sixes. Yay, go me. I wish I blitzed the right player. Fucking stupid. Maybe I am tilting a bit. But it's hard to know, isn't it? It's hard to know when you're tilting and when you're just doing shit. <laughs> That's the uh, <laughs> that's the problem, <laughs> you know, like uh, on racing games, when Bruffy's racing, they always like say, you know, people choke and stuff, and it's like, um, I don't really, you know, it's hard to know whether I'm choking or not in racing games, because it, my, my usual level is so low, maybe I'm just doing, you know, just making normal mistakes. Four dice and a no push, one in 36. But I mean, if you don't mean like, if you include pals, that's success. One in nine, one in 81. Wait, what? Four dice into no push. So then, I don't know what you mean. 
You mean getting the push? Getting the push on two dice is, is dodgy, isn't it? It's 55% to get a push and then... So it's like about 80% or something. It depends what you're talking about. I don't know. I don't know. I don't understand the question, Barbara Fusak. I, I should have made it three dice. I should have blitzed the, the guard uh, and then it would have been three dice. Hello, Lemon is good. Going terribly. As you can tell. Yeah, all right, yeah, that was about, yeah, about 20% of fail, yeah. But I should have done three dice, so it's my fault. Simple as. Yeah, but you know, you can't, again, Harry Q, you can't judge it on what actually happens, can you? You've got to go by, like, the percentage chances to say what the best player was. And I could have made them three dices and just didn't. So it was there for the wrong play. KO, that's good. It's like a Kaz, isn't it, second half? As far as the game is concerned, I get all right. Let's safe moves first. Safe moves go. That's a pretty big one, isn't it? Because this could be a one in twelve nine six. Excellent. No, I'm not going to try to score twice, no. No, of course not. There's no chance of being able to score twice. Good shout with the apple there, I think. Ten V ten after all that. No nine. Only nine. Three, six, nine. Oh I forgot I forgot best forgot. <laughs> um Minus movement, then the apple was a death. So there's been three deaths in a row. Um, but one was an apple result, so managed to keep him with minus move. I mean, gonna have to keep him obviously with my. I'd keep him with minus strength at this point. And the good thing about losing the wrestle frenzy is, the strength guy can get uh, frenzy, can't he? And then I'll be better anyway. <laughs> Giving the team a head start. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Completely forgot him. Holy shit. But yeah, he's he's got the movement to catch up, hasn't he? It's knee bother.
Yeah, it's a draw. Yeah, it's Peter to draw. Yeah, he won the toss. That's the thing. If I'd won the toss, start off with two KOs, he wouldn't have appalled that KO if it had been in the first half. So we'd have started off 11 versus 9 and would have had the claw palm to tee off on him for the whole half. So, you know, ultimately it was losing the toss, turned a win into a draw, and due to Fagor into fucked. Which is a shame. Safe moves first, blitz with claw. Brilliant. Just what we wanted. Fuck all. I hope you come. Hope you come best for God. <laughs> Holy shit, didn't, didn't one in nine. Outrageously. power roll there get those two in <laughs> because bite size center the reason and conflict and milk the reason that I was playing in the first place was in case you in case you knew as well because I can see the kappa face but at the time that I started spinning, I was second chaos. However, oh yes, greed, fuck you. Finally punished. Fuckhead. I think I go for the claw hit, don't I? <laughs> Classic. Classic push. get forward or some somehow <laughs> why not re-rolled in the skulls <laughs> So if he'd saved his wizard now, he would have got five even higher quality players than the ones that he hit. <laughs> and he could have put unbelievable pressure on. But of course not. He just fucking he just fucking wasted it on turn one. The worst possible use of a wizard. And <laughs> got as lucky as he could get. Outrageous. Left that side very weak, hasn't he, with the downed, the downed dwarf. Of course. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck you, man. Jesus fucking Christ. Can I just... Don't just wish you could punch people through the internet. Fucking hell. Lucky <laughs> fucking cunt. <laughs> Holy shit. True bite side centre, true. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Aha, yes, cunt. Good. No, not dead, but good. Good. His apple failed as well, to be fair. Find this motherfucker and steal his mom, kill all the food in his fridge and fuck his dog. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Um. <laughs> I'm thinking I'm movement eight and I can get there, but I, I I can't because obviously I'm not movement eight. The, the ball carrier can get to where he wants to be, but unfortunately, he ain't got the fucking ball. So I guess I just gotta go back here then. <laughs> yeah, the break, the break tackle's shut down really, isn't it, with the tackle, the tackle in there, and you'd have to run so far around that I think, yeah, obviously Bludge BT is, is a motherfucker. Yeah, the strength guy, I want to sand off the strength guy eventually. Really, the strength guy should have been one in front, so that if he based the ball, I could have had the cheeky handoff away. Um, obviously, strength guy wants to score because he'd get up to frenzy. Even best for goal wouldn't mind scoring. He hasn't played that bad, but he hasn't had the chance to really, although he's taken forever every turn. Being three men up instantly, there wasn't much he could do wrong, was there? Apart from apart from greed re-rolling blocks that caused him finally. Now he's got less guys as well, hasn't he? Nine. Versus nine though. Knowing that I can't hit the ball with the claw warrior. Hand off to strength for going past the best player. No, I can't do that. Not in the game I'm losing. I'm not Andy Dayball. <laughs> is this shit don't even hit with mighty blow just stun a warrior one dies power warrior yeah why not not even block not even blocking with block 
Just cheeky one dice pile. Motherfucker. Right. He is overcommitted here, hasn't he? A little bit. Like a little bit of a newbie boy. Haha, <laughs> set us up for the massive push there. Huge. Fuck him. Really sure that dwarf who's boss. Fuck yeah. Go for the handoff now. I need, I need that. The best guy's got to have the ball, hasn't he? Really. <sighs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> Just like any knockdowns would be nice, wouldn't they? And then, of course, Powell's re-rolled into Powell's when, when trying to get the chain push. <laughs> oh, man. But, yeah, that was my fault. I should have made a three dice all the way. I don't think he's very good. But, obviously, the potato is very weak against a blodge break tackle bull. So, I need to get a fucking knockdown in the next two turns to make the score looking likely, haven't I? Maybe I could have greeted that one. With only three turns left after it. Hopefully, Squirrel Dude, it's looking like a fucking massacre though. Dead Dirty Player, Dead Frenzy, Minus Movement Killer, all in the first three turns. And then random Kaz on him. Miss next game. Good. That's what you get for all the fucking GFI. Cunt. Yeah, tie it best. I, I'm, I'm sick as I'm sick as fuck that I didn't need to play it. I've got to do quite well just to uh, just to maintain the fucking points that I'm on. Good, bit banged on prick. That's pretty nice, isn't it? That was a, that was pretty lucky to be fair. Um, could blitz him and then block him. I could just blitz this one and then still block him that way, yeah. I guess get, getting forward safely is the aim and that's the way to do it, isn't it? Holy shit. Got a knockdown. Shit. 
fucking GFI. Well, at least I've saved all my rerolls for this moment. <laughs> Mighty push. Oh, yeah. Maybe she went too far forward. Maybe she should just been back here. I saw this way I've got the guards here so we can't cage bomb with the uh, cage dive with the break tackle. <laughs> then how you know he does the MMA? <laughs> yeah, exactly, lemon is good, yeah. <laughs> Two heads, yeah, probably. It's the first game today, backyard order. I don't know how much what the team is. I'm just sick of the cunt of the fucking first game. The thing is, the Bulls being out of position doesn't matter because they can come back nine, can't they? And he doesn't have. The, unfortunately, the dwarves aren't out of position. His dwarves are all in the right neck of the woods. The hobs can move. The bulls can move. The fuck up but one don't you dude. I guess I guess that's a, that's a fair assessment. <laughs> I can't even think of doing that. He can't even be considering it. Maybe he just doesn't want me to forget that he's got blood break tackle. the GFIs at once, just like you should. you need to fucking <laughs> God. make sure you use the last 15 seconds buddy Jesus Christ oh <laughs> brilliant oh boo that was an epic last second maneuver that Still probably fucked it doing it, to be fair. He's still probably, he's still, well, it was still probably a mistake, wasn't it? When you think about it. Let's just get the guard in here. 
say hello to my little friend. It's a little bit unsafe now, isn't it? It was a 1 in 81. So not that unsafe. Alright, so now I've got to blitz him with him. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So I've got to make the cage like here. Hopefully. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oof. That's a bit rough, isn't it? GFIs. I've got to do this blitz first anyway and see what happens. I guess I just take it and then he goes in. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So no, you can't really run around that side, can you? And chain him out, but not all of them. You can just dodge in there for a one dice. If he goes there, it's safer, isn't it? <laughs> oh, God. Classic. You can just four plus out, one dice the ball. But I can block him first. <laughs> Genius. I don't think he can run around there, can he? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, he can't, can he? I think that should be good. <laughs> it feels like a crazy lemur, yeah. Yeah, but if you break tackles in this way, then it's got to go through tackle. He's got a reroll still, but it means he hasn't got a reroll on the hit, doesn't it? I couldn't like I couldn't really stop it, could I? With, with without the knockdowns, if I'd got the knockdown, if if the warrior had got the knockdown, he could have maybe tried the two GFIs, but. I think without the knockdown I had to follow and keep him occupied. Plus it was two GFIs which is fucking risky wasn't it? Five plus for two dice, I guess it's worth it isn't it? He could have, yeah, he could have yeah, avoided the tackle, yeah, if he'd, if he'd gone. Yeah, he could have avoided the tackle. Good call, bite side centre. Wouldn't have mattered, though, as it happened. But, yeah, that would probably been the better play, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, go to there and then dodge in that way, yeah. Yeah, that's fair enough. Fair play. I just really want to hurt his team because I don't like him, so... 
<laughs> uh, there's no one here make the blitz there, is there? Because he can come in here. Might get star player points, eh? Only want to block with block. I guess there's more chance of getting a Kaz there, isn't there? But then just can't hit these guys. So yeah, alright then. I just got block anyway, so it doesn't matter. I can blitz this Hobgoblin. Nearly quad skulls. <laughs> Nearly quad skulls to finish it off. That would have been... That would have been fucking typical ending. <laughs> Three out of four skulls. <laughs> fucking hell. Oh, shit. Who's the most expendable then? I guess this block guard mighty blow guy is the most expendable of the uh, of the players. I do take a while to move them back here. I do apologise, Pedro. VIP Pedro Jack. It just takes me a while. Blitz with a quick snap. So a draw is bad. Um, might force us into another game. Probably will force us into another game. Yeah, yeah. Considering the first turn. Well, the first three turns. It was, uh, it's all right in it in the end. <laughs> yeah, barbecue sack. <laughs> yeah, drawn a second. Yeah, the ground did more damage. <laughs> yeah, the draw because the draw is like half wooden, half a loss, isn't it? Which is fifty percent win record. And they were like about 78 or something, so getting a draw obviously lowers your win percentage. So it's always dangerous to play more games. <gasps> I put them together like an asshole. Oh man, there's no need to put them together like this. There's no excuse for ever putting your LOS together, and I did. Holy shit. If he gets this one turn here, I feel really bad. I mean, obviously the excuse was because he's just going to block and foul. I didn't think he'd even try the one turn, but even then, you just shouldn't do it, should you? Yeah, it'd be easy to get games at least, yeah. And I guess to be fair, the the the, the dirty player, while, he, while he'd be good in the finals, he's not 100% essential, is he? 13 players isn't 100% essential. And the frenzy guy can get replaced by a better frenzy guy with plus strength once he gets the level up, so it, it's not that bad actually for the team. It, the, the big thing is the movement, minus movement on the killer is just fucking horrible. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> fucking brats.
I don't think I've played a Stunty Chiming Champ. I don't know, Backyard Dodo. Despite a full bank, 150k bank. So, um... I mean, it's going to be it's going to be journeyman for the next game. But oh god, yeah! If the killer gets jump up, that's that's obviously amazing. Oh, give a quick snap and I fucking settle. But he's going to get the one turn. Oh man! Oh no! No! Why did I set up like that? There's just no excuse for ever ever setting up like that. He's got no rerolls though, and he's got to get it to an agility two ball, and he's only got a break tackle on one of the dodges, so. Uh, the ogre team was just open before before champs ladder started. Oh well, it was when, it was when Shawnee was playing champs ladder, so there was like no point in champs ladder. But he's fucked this, hasn't he? He managed to <laughs> he managed to completely fuck fuck it by requiring an extra push. So that was clever of him. Yeah, now he's getting the gym pals, isn't he? Wastes another push. It's horrible, isn't it? Horrible. If he gets this one turn after he's wasted two pushes, I'll uh, I'll feel bad. <laughs> this will be the last game of the day if he scores this one turn. Fucking hell. Now it dawns on him that he put the uh, ball in the wrong square. Guess he can rectify it. Of course he's gone for it now, though. He's just, it's just taken him a, a while to work it out. Because he, because every dice roll he makes succeeds. It's all right. The ball should have gone here, shouldn't he, for the next, for the next push. For the bullet gone here. And he could have pushed him to there and then pushed him out there. But um Even then is he, is he two more? Yeah, he just needs two more. So yeah. Yeah, both this bull should have GFI to here. No, oh, yeah, he can do it that way. Oh fair enough, he can do it that way. It just means he didn't have block, but I guess he needs the push anyway, doesn't he? Alright, lucky dingle. I was a bit stupid there. No, Jelly, you didn't see him wasting two pushes to get there. He's just rolled two more pushes than he had to. Um, after getting a quick snap. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Wait, what? It's scattered to him anyway. Are you shitting me? It's scattered to him. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God, he could have still scored. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. That was outrageous. Oh well, there you go. Fucking horrible, isn't it? He only got five AV rigs in the whole match. It's just that three of them were in like the first three turns. He got out blocked quite heavily. But from his from his uh, six AV breaks, he got. He got two miss next games and two kills and an apple failure. And did them on the first three turns as well. Like, well, not all of them, but three of them in the first three turns. 
1450, much easier to get a game at 1450 at least. <laughs> Best for go. Come on, double for dodge. That's what we, that's what we all want. No. I guess two heads then. I'm thinking two heads. Don't have 180k, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's no point buying two rookies. Just have the journeyman for now. I'll even keep the 20k. And then just see what happens after this next match. 20k blow isn't the end of the world, is it? <laughs> Well, that was a disappointing game to have to play. Um, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.